I'm going to show you how to treat your rose if it's infected with black spots. Now, this rose has a slight infestation, and you can just see the black spot on the leaves. Now, with a slight infestation, all you'll need to do is just literally take the infected leaves off the rose, like that, and then just give it a light trim afterwards, which I'm going to demonstrate now. With a heavy infestation, you'll need to take all the leaves off the rows and then trim it back by about a third, and that'll just encourage it to flush out the growth again. Now, I'm going to start with the trimming, because otherwise you just end up taking leaves off where you're going to actually cut the branches off. So if we take it back by about a third, just there, and just tidy it up nicely, and always cut just above a leaf node and angling towards the leaf node. So the higher point is always towards the leaf node. And get a nice rounded shape and that way it looks quite natural. Now you can always cut a little bit more as well but you can never get that growth back. So if you're not sure, just cut a little bit off and you can always cut a little bit more off. And now I'm going to take all the infected leaves off the rows. So now we've done that, we can see now that we've got just a couple of bits of dead wood from the previous season. Now, that's just literally just a black stalk all we need to do is just prune that back to the next branch there. And it just cleans it up and tides it up. It won't do the rose any harm. Now, black spot is a fungal disease and it's spread by water. So watering on top of the rose will just encourage it. So you always want to water at the base of the plant. Also, good aeration also is good for the rose and prevents black spot. So if you've got plants crowding the rows and preventing the air from circulating that'll also give your plant black spot really. You can use something like rose clear to give your rows um, a nice spray and stop it from or prevent it from getting black spot but at the same time if it's a heavy infestation then you really are better just stripping back the leaves giving it a light prune and letting the plant start again really it won't take long. And that's all you have to do really, just take these leaves, what I have now, make sure you incinerate them or burn them in the fire um, because you want to get rid of the disease and not spread it to other plants. Other than that, it really is that simple.